Leon, first of all, welcome to KV Mechel. It's been a long and busy day for you. How are you feeling right now? Yeah, I'm a bit tired, but I'm also happy to be here. I'm excited. And yeah, let's um, look forward for the preseason. Can you tell our fans what did you already do today? Yeah, today we, I start really early. Um, uh, we start with the orthopedic tests and um, after that we take some uh, pictures and um, yeah, we then um, I do the cardiologic um, tests and after that we sign the contract and um, finish with the running test. So that's quite busy, but right now everything is signed, so officially welcome. Yes, thank you. <laughs> um, up until now, you only played for teams in the north of Germany, that's correct, right? Yeah, that's correct. Can you take us through your journey as a football player? Where did you start? What were your next steps? Um, yeah, I started uh, really early at four years old and um, took the steps all, um, to the uh, profis. And um, after one year, I leave um, to another club. And um, yeah, I had a good season dot and go to the second league in Germany. And um, after that, um, I changed to um, the third league again. And um, after that, I go to Braunschweig. Um, and now I'm here and happy. Okay. You're born and raised in Erfurt, right? Yes, Erfurt. Can you tell us something about the city of Erfurt? Because you were born and raised over there. Nobody knows the city better than you. Yeah, Erfurt is really nice. It's a, a really nice uh, city center. Um, also had... Uh, uh, and when it's Christmas, a good uh, Christmas market. And yeah, it's nice to live there. Uh, it's not that big. It's, it's uh, similar to Mechelen, I think. Okay, maybe a little bit bigger. A little bit bigger, yeah. And can you tell us something about the journey as a football player? Because you started at four years old. Was it also at Erfurt? Yeah, at Erfurt, yeah. Okay, and then through the whole academy. Yeah. And finally in the first, in the first team. What was your feeling the moment you played the first time for the first team? Yeah, I couldn't realize uh, realize that um, at first, but yeah, you developed really fast, and so after maybe two months, it was not not so so special anymore. And but I was also happy to be there and um, play for my boyhood club. How old were you when you made your? I debut? was uh, 19 years old. Yeah, 19 years old. Okay. And then you made your debut. Yes. Okay. Yes. And after one season, you yeah, I, I left because um, effort goes down, and I want to stay in the uh, in the in the league, so I had to move. Two seasons ago, you had an impressive season with Braunschweig, twelve goals in thirty-two games, and you helped them to get to the German second division. Yes. Can you tell us something about that season? How was it to take Braunschweig from third division to second division? Um, yeah, it was a nice season um, for, for the club, but also for me. Um, yeah, the, the club always struggled to stay in the second league. So it uh, was our goal to, to um, get up and hold the league. And um, last season we, we um, could do that. And yeah, we were happy about that. And it was um, also um, good for my head to know that um, we stay in the league. And now I moved. Yeah, you managed to stay in the second division, but you really had to fight until the last second. Yes. Can you tell us something about that last game or the last couple of games? What was the feeling when the referee called the game and said it was over, you stay in second division? Yeah, it was difficult for us because um, it's always in our head and maybe we go down and uh, couldn't stay in the league. But um, luckily, we in the other club, and played um, at the same time, um, so they won uh, their game, and it doesn't matter. Um, our game doesn't matter anymore. But yeah, after the final whistle, um, every um, pressure goes away, and um, we were happy. What is the biggest feeling of satisfaction? Getting the team from third division to second division, or those last seconds where you know we're staying second division? Well, it's a different feeling because if you um, want to stay in the league, it's always the pressure to stay in the league. And if you um, have the possibility to go up, it's, it's a positive feeling, I think. Um, so I would say it's better to, to go up. After your first season at Braunschweig, where you sco scored 12 goals, Mechelen was already interested. Is that correct? Yeah, that's correct. Okay, but you choose 
to stay at Braunschweig anyway. At that moment, what made you say, I'm going to stay over here, this is my place where I have to be? Yeah, at that moment, um, I want to finish uh, the job there to, to stay in the league and have a good uh, finish with uh, Braunsch uh, Braunschweig to finish the project. And that was um, important for me. So that's the, the main reason. The interest from KV Mechelen persisted. You had a couple of visits over here before you signed. Can you share us something about the process of the transfer? When did you make up your mind and say, right now, this feels good, I'm going to sign in Mechelen? Um, maybe it was three or four weeks ago. I had some really good um, calls with Tim and he uh, gave me a really good feeling. Um, he supports me and um, yeah, push, pushes my uh, confidence. So um, yeah, what, uh, I, I visited here and it was really nice from the first moment and had a good feeling here, the atmosphere. And so I would say three or four weeks ago, yeah, I decided to, to come here. Okay. What do you think about the language? Because today we were on the road and there were a couple of times that you saw a word and you told me that's that and that's that. Yeah, it's, it's a bit similar to, to German. Um, sometimes there's uh, just a one letter um, switched and you, can, you, you see a German word, so it's, it's not that difficult to, to understand. Um, so maybe I could learn a, a bit Netherlands. Okay, so the integration will go pretty good. Yeah, I hope so, I hope so. Okay, thank you for your time, Leon, and viel Glück in Mechelen. Dankeschön, dankeschön.